Okay guys, this is a video on how to um get a custom clock. If you're wondering about my background, I have another video on that. Uh so I'll you watch my other video on how to get it. As you can see right now, I have a custom clock and I'll show you how to get it and how to customize it. So first you wanna go to your start and go to whatever internet browse you have, I use Safari, and go up to the top and type in google.com and then the um in the bar type in free desktop clock and say enter and then the very first one it says free desktop clock in bold and then download it should be the very first one so then you get this and then there is one column two column and then the third column at the very bottom it says download click that say open I already have it so it won't go through the process and say and then um it'll ask you to run then you'll say open and you go to setup and you say run and then you go down and you say English or whatever your language you want it to be say okay next I accept next 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 I'm not going to install it, but then you click install, and you say finish. Um, and then, oh wait, sorry people, I actually do have to install it, run, okay, next, next, accept, next, 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 next. All. Oh, that other checkbox was for if you want a desktop icon, but you really don't need one because it, it automatically starts up when Windows starts. So then it'll say launch free desktop clock. You want to do that because you you, if you don't have a desktop icon, say finish, exit out of this folder, and then if you exit out of that, if you see, right when you say finish, your custom uh, clock comes up. Now, to change it, right click on it. It'll say automatically clock, exit, make taskbar, date time property, sets for if you want to change it. Then you go to main dialog. And something that, like that should show up. And then, uh, I, I personally don't like the 24 hour format. So I'm going to say use 12 hour format. That means instead of being like oh like 1744, like that's what time it is, it's 544. And then this is where you can um change if you want to use the transparent background, it depends which one you have. Like if I want if I click transparent background, you can't really read it. If you can see that, can't read it. And then when I say don't use transparent background, you can read it again. So I'm not, I don't like that. But then you just go to select skin and then whatever you want, when you want. I personally like counter strike. I think that's pretty cool. And when you click it, it automatically previews what it will look like. So I want, if I wanted, uh, I don't know, goblin then that's what goblin would look like if I wanted I don't know photo that's what photo would look like so yeah pretty much pick whatever one you want um but I'm gonna go with counter strike and you can and then you again there's another box that says use transparent background but I don't want to because it will just mess it up and then you just click OK and exit out of the web page and there you have it that's how you get a custom desktop clock i hope this helped 
Make sure to leave comments. Tell me if there's anything I forgot or if there's anything you need help with with your computer or really anything else in that matter. Thanks again.